My name is Brian Potter. I'm a research meteorologist with the U.S. Forest Service in the Seattle Fire Lab. I work on atmosphere fire interactions, trying to understand how the fire influences the atmosphere and how the atmosphere in turn influences the fire. It all goes back and forth, loops around. Um, I work on questions on scales from single plumes of smoke coming off of part of the fire line and the air motions that make those rise faster or inhibit them, all the way up to cold fronts moving through and how the three-dimensional structure of the atmosphere and how that's changing is gonna affect how a fire behaves. So ranges from questions that can be fed into fire line, firefighter safety, and smoke transport and dispersion up to broader scale firefighter safety and resource management where you've got to manage large fire units and be prepared for the big weather changes. So I'm down here at the Tall Timbers Research Station this week watching the, the prescribed burns to get some sort of just gut senses of how things happen in these particular kinds of forests. I'm not running my own experiment this week, but I've been helping out with others and um, giving feedback and looking at the micrometeorology, the weather conditions under the canopy, how individual gaps behave and influence the fire and things like that. There aren't many places in the country where you get a collaboration of researchers from across the country and engagement with land managers all at the same time. There are a few other um, cooperative field campaigns that have happened, the RX Cadre burns several years ago and the upcoming hopefully fire and smoke modeling uh, experiments from the Joint Fire Science Funding. Those are the kind of integrative things that, that this fits in with, but this is so ad hoc and relatively simple logistically that, that it's just a, a pretty unique opportunity in that respect.